Welcome to WebHavi Web Scraping Workshop. In this video, we will see how WebHavi can be configured to scrape data from TripAdvisor hotel listings. Now, before we go ahead and launch the website and start selecting data, we should do some settings changes which are specific for the TripAdvisor website. Go to WebHavi settings and on minor tab, click on the advanced minor options and select value 1 for maximum number of parallel mining threads. Go to the browser tab and select use separate browser engine for mining links. Apply these changes. Now since these changes are specific to this website, you can reset the settings to default before attempting to scrape and mine other websites. So now we can go ahead and load the TripAdvisor website and let's go to the hotel listings page of the city which we are interested in and once the page is loaded we can start configuring WebHavi where we teach WebHavi what all data which we need to extract. So start the configuration by clicking the start button and now WebHavi is in configuration mode you can select any data which you need to extract during the mining phase. Now the general rule of thumb is to ignore any sponsored listings which can appear upfront on the page because these listings may only appear on some pages and can disrupt the scraping process. So ignore them. Start with the first non-sponsored listing. Now before that it's a good practice to click on the page and select more options page and scroll down. Now this just scrolls down the page during mining to make sure all elements on the page are correctly loaded. Now since we are already here, we can click on the next page button and set it as the next page link so that WebHarvey knows how to automatically go through each of these pages to get additional data. Let's go back to the first non-sponsored listing and start selecting data. Let's start with the name. We can also get the URL of the hotel listings details page. We can now follow this link to load the hotel details page from where we can select additional data. Once the page is loaded, we can just start selecting data. Let's start with the reviews followed by the rank, address, phone, website. Now this would be a redirected link. Let's also get the default image displayed. If you want to get multiple images of websites, we have another video on the channel. We can refer to that. In this case, we are getting only this default image displayed here. Scrolling down, we can get the rating. MNDs can be extracted or selected using the capture following text method, which is the recommended practice when the data which you need to extract is guaranteed to occur after a heading text. Like for example, room features, capture following text. And types. Now assuming we have selected all required data from the page, we can stop the configuration and start mining. Click on the start button in the minor window. WebHavi asks whether, you know, you can select a folder where downloaded images can be placed. In this case, I hit cancel and image URLs will be downloaded instead. WebHavi is loading the same page for which we created the configuration and it will start pulling the data from the listings page. A small change, let's also increase the AJAX load wait time to 10 seconds so that it works under all scenarios.
you can see that the Webavi has fetched the name and URL from the starting page. Now it will follow each hotel link to get additional data. We hope you find this video useful. In case you have any questions, please feel free to ask us in the comment section or better contact us at support at We usually reply to queries within 24 hours. Thank you.